What are the common conditions that mupirocin 2% ointment is used for? Hello everyone. Welcome back to our channel. Today, we're going to talk about a commonly used ointment called mupirocin 2%. In this video, we'll explore the various conditions for which this ointment is commonly used. So, let's dive in. What is Mupirocin 2% ointment? Mupirocin 2% ointment is a topical medication that belongs to a class of drugs called antibiotics. It is commonly used to treat certain types of bacterial skin infections. Treating Impetigo one of the primary conditions that mupirocin 2% ointment is used for is impetigo. Impetigo is a highly contagious bacterial skin infection that primarily affects children. It is characterized by red sores or blisters, typically around the nose and mouth. Mupirocin 2% ointment is effective in treating impetigo by killing the bacteria responsible for the infection. Managing secondary skin infections. In addition to impetigo, mupirocin 2% ointment is also used to treat secondary skin infections. These infections can occur when the skin is already damaged, such as in cases of eczema, minor cuts, or scrapes. The ointment helps prevent the growth of bacteria in these damaged areas, reducing the risk of infection. Nasal Carriage of Methicillin-Resistant Staphylococcus aureus, MRSA Another common use for mupirocin 2% ointment is the decolonization of methicillin-resistant Staphylococcus aureus, MRSA, in the nasal passages. MRSA is a type of bacteria that is resistant to many antibiotics and can cause serious infections. Applying mupirocin 2% ointment inside the nostrils helps eliminate the bacteria from the nasal passages, reducing the risk of spreading the infection to others or reinfection of the individual. Prevention of Surgical Site Infections Mupirocin 2% ointment may also be used as a preventive measure for surgical site infections. Before certain surgical procedures, especially those involving the nose, throat, or skin, mupirocin ointment can be applied to the area to reduce the bacterial load and lower the risk of postoperative infections. That's a wrap for today's video on the common conditions that mupirocin 2% ointment is used for. Remember, it's always important to consult with a healthcare professional before starting any medication. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing to our channel for more informative content. Take care and stay healthy. Note, this video is for informational purposes only and should not be considered medical advice. Always consult with a healthcare professional for proper diagnosis and treatment.